Hi guys, Jim at Rainwater Equipment and Rain Harvesting Supplies here. Today we are talking about the EasyBox Mini 3 pump. Uh, I've talked uh, previously about this particular pump on other videos and today we're going to focus on kind of what comes in the box and how to reverse the uh, shutter valve or non-return valve in the instance when you're using flooded suction. Flooded suction meaning whenever you open a ball valve to a water tank for example and water comes rushing into the uh, pump. That would be conversely different than where this pump is having to do a suction lift where it's lifting water and then pushing. This pump comes with two one inch threaded nipples. The nipples actually have uh, arrows on them. The arrows are supposed to face toward the pump when you install it. So you get one here and one here. They need to be hand tight and then a slight turn uh, to kind of seat it after that to make sure it's completely tight. Don't over tighten, you could risk uh, damaging the housing. It also comes with these four feet that screw on on the bottom of the pump so that you can level it and make it sit without rocking. And um, let's go ahead and look at uh, the back side of the pump here. You'll see that it comes with a 110 plug with a cable, a quick start guide, and you'll notice here on uh, the quick start guide, this is the instructions on how to uh, do the, the swap out or the, uh, the change if you're doing flooded suction. The pump actually comes preset with this shutter valve going one direction. So we unscrew this plastic piece on the back. It has a little rubber cover on it. And you're gonna need a pair of pliers needle nose pliers to pull this check valve out. Fortunately, I was able to get it there with my hand. Comes out like this, facing this direction. For flooded suction, you simply just remove the spring, bring the spring to the front side like this, put the mechanism back in the pump with the spring on the outside, and then there's a, an O-ring inside this cap and you push against that o-ring and then screw it on hand tight to about right there and stop and that will not uh, leak so again this video was about how to uh, switch out the shutter valve facing a different direction following the quick start guide for flooded suction